Hey, 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 YouTube. It's me, Matt, from A to Z Diecast with some Fox Bodies. Oh, for those of you who don't follow me, follow me if you like Mustangs, especially Foxes, because it's a lot that I open are Foxes. <clears throat> what we have here is the latest exclusive from LP Diecast, LP Project Garage. Well, it's actually LP Diecast. See? LP Diecast Garage. This is their Project Garage. So these are exclusives to LP Diecast, LP Diecast Garage. Um, this is the standard release. These are the chases. These chases are raw. Um, so let's open these up, then I'll give you my thoughts and feelings. And... Um, Check it, check it, check it out. So, a little slicing and dicing. Let's open this bad boy up. Those out. These out. <clears throat> okay. So, let's check out the regulars first. Black 89 GT Black with very silver on the bottom. Fast 5.0 for the plate. What do you think's under the hood? Yep, standard 5.0 motor. 5.0 here. Almost with a hint of of metallic in there. Um, being that I owned a 93 LX, not a GT. The black did not have the sparkles in this. It, it's slightly there. Um, I can see it. So if I can see it, other people can see it. Um, it was just plain black. This has a... I mean, it looks plain black. Blah, 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 black. But if you look closely, there is some sparkles in it. So, um, not a true uh, color, but I still like it. That's why I bought it. Uh, little paint defect there. There's what it looks like underneath. There's your 89. Here's another 89. Um, pink! Not just pink. But, oh, a little mess up with the tire over here. But we got our drag hood, or almost like the dra drag setup, we'll call it. Slicks and skinnies. There's your slicks, there's your skinnies. Pink. Um, this might be the first pink from green light that I know of. Underneath the hood, standard Fox motor, unpainted. This one. Got some silver on it. You can see that? This one. Err. No silver. Fast 5.0 as the um, license plate. As you see, the car itself is the same except for the hood. The rims and rim setup are different. So with the cowl hood. If you're a Fox Body fan, you know many, many issues with hoods. Got the hood pins on this one. So let's check out the chases. Let's check out the raws. So here is the raw of the Plane 89. Definitely can see that it's raw up top because you can see the plain metal. Underneath, it's still silver because that is the, just like this one had. Ooh, ooh we got a little mess up on the tail lights. So, green light, messed up. This is another one of these. It's just on the other side. So I got, <laughs> they put the wrong tail light on. This is a uh, passenger side tail light, flipped upside down on the driver's side. 
Motor still painted. Motor still painted. But it's painted differently. No, that's just overspray. So there we go. Hood really comes up. Okay. So we got a little overspray on the intake. You see that? Intake it's the uh, well, the actual air intake, the air box has some silver overspray where this one it's also sticking up. Get in there. Where this one, the raw is sitting nicely, no overspray. And here comes the chase for the 89 drag setup. Got some Mickey Thompson's. I wanted to see if it was the same. Yep, it's the same. This one's coming off though. Um, again, you can see the raw metal up top. It's almost the same, almost the same design-ish thing on the metal up there. A little hard to see, but it does have the hood pins on this because it is. They did go with silver as well. Non-painted, hard to get up because of the cowl. And these taillights are right. These are correct. But they did silver on these. So, and these are pink. And these are black. And these are silver. So at least they kept the, the oops, sorry, not on camera. So again, Here's the taillights on the two raws. They did paint the body paint like it's supposed to be on a GT. There, but as you can see, this one's got the wrong taillight on the driver's side. A little couple of paint defects, but it's it's a 164. What are you going to do? So again, um, thank you, LP Diecast, but unthank you for my wallet. But uh, glad to have these in my collection. Um, if you don't have, if you haven't checked out their stuff, go check out their stuff. They're coming out with some nice stuff, as you see. Uh, but again, I think this is the first pink from Greenlight that I saw. I don't remember anything else, but it could be wrong. Could have been something that they put out before. But um, that's it. Thanks for watching. Don't forget to like, subscribe, check out the rest of my videos. Peace.